Elementor versus WordPress. So what's the difference between Elementor and WordPress? Well, WordPress is a system for running your entire website. It's called a CMS or a content management system. And Elementor is a plugin designed for WordPress sites that helps you take all the features of WordPress and then expand it by making it very easy to design websites with a drag and drop editor. So I'll show you a little more about the difference. WordPress is like a framework that helps you build your website and it's very popular because it has been around for a very long time and it is very easy to install themes to make your website look um, very different uh, with just a couple of cl clicks. You can see a bunch of different popular themes for WordPress here. It also is uh, very easy to create content. So you can see here, this is the default WordPress editor and you can see that it's easy to uh, type paragraphs um, in the default WordPress editor, you can also do things like headings, you can do images um, pretty easily. However, if you want to take your experience to a uh, higher level design wise, then you might want to look into Elementor. So um, I have Elementor installed on my site, so I'll show you what it looks like here. And this is, um, I just, I installed the Elementor plugin, which you can look for other videos on how to do that. And then um, once you do that, then every post on your WordPress site has an option to edit it in Elementor. So you see over here, this is what Elementor adds. A bunch of different options. Um, these are basically fancier options for making your content um, better. And specifically, it's drag and drop. So if you choose image over here, then you can, you know, uh, drop any kind of image into your web, your page easily. If I can get my head out of the way. <laughs> um, and then if you want to then go add a heading here, it's very easy to do that. And another advantage of adding Elementor is number one, it's free. Um, at least the basic version is, which is incredibly extensive. And then there is a pro version too, um, that adds a lot more features, but most people use the free version. And I think at this point it's got over 5 million view, uh, users. So it's very popular. Um, and you can see why if you're building content visually, um, then the drag and drop features are really useful. Um, so here are tons of different features here, and it's really amazing plugin. Like I said, it's free. And then there's a pro version if you want to um, expand beyond that. And so that's the difference between WordPress and Elementor. If you do want to try out Elementor, you can check out the links in the video description below and uh, check it out through my affiliate link if you want. If not, no worries.